I'm just a kid. In fact, I haven't even been born yet. I might be a boy or a girl. I might live in a city or a town or even on a farm. And one day, a few years from now, or 10 years from now, or even 20 years from now, I will be a member of the YMCA. I'll learn to swim at your Y. I'll learn to be skillful and confident in the water. I will skin my knees diving for a rebound in basketball. I'll meet new people. I'll make friends and we'll play together. And I will learn to be a good friend at the YMCA. Maybe I will be lucky enough to attend a summer day camp. Maybe I'll get to go fishing or build a lemonade stand. Maybe I will train like a Jedi or compete in a triathlon or a cupcake war. No matter what the camp name, I will be surrounded by friends and counselors who make me feel like I belong. I will embrace the culture of the Y, the healthy, active lifestyle, the sense of community and the feeling of acceptance. I might get my first job at the Y. I could be a lifeguard or a babysitting attendant. As I grow up and as my focus and needs change, so will my Y. I will find my friends in yoga and body pump instead of at camp. We will support each other as we set goals and work to achieve them. Even if I hit a rough patch, if I become diabetic or diagnosed with cancer, the Y will pick me up. If I am a single mom or dad, the Y will be a place for my family to gather and belong. And as I grow older and my activity slows a bit, the Y will give me a chair to exercise from and a warm pool to enjoy. I will surround myself with others who long to connect with friends and cherish that sense of belonging that means more to me now than ever. When I look back to what the Y has meant to me in my life, the YMCA is a place of community in my community. Who knows? Like I've said, I haven't even been born yet. But I wanted to tell you all, today, right now, reaching through time, how vital the YMCA is to the foundation of our community and how much I appreciate it.